AMS 2140, Advanced Cross-Channel Measurements. In this tutorial, I will show you how to collect advanced cross-channel measurements on up to four channels using the AMS 2140. As we review this technique, you'll note a visual reference to the CSI 2140. Please be aware that this product has been rebranded as AMS. When you collect advanced cross-channel data, you normally have one reference sensor and up to three response sensors. The minimum would be one reference sensor and one response sensor. The data collected will be available for review in a variety of plot types. The reference sensor and each of the three response sensors will produce both a waveform and a spectrum. Three coherence plots are created by looking at the coherence between the three response plots from channels B, C, and D versus the reference plot from channel A. You can have three cross-channel plots. For the transfer functions, there are three based on reference divided by response and three based on response divided by reference. For viewers new to vibration analysis, Transfer function expresses the relationship between periodic force and the vibration produced. Here you see the home screen of the AMS 2140. To collect advanced cross-channel measurements, start with F7 Advanced Analyze, then F1 Manual Analyze. Next, select F1 Set Analyze Mode and choose Advanced Cross-Channel from the drop-down menu. Use F2 set spectra parameters to specify your F max. In this case, we will use 0 to 1000 Hz with 1600 lines of resolution and normal averages. We are using four sensors, so select F12 input setup. Here you see we have already configured accelerometers. Select F1 select input to confirm all four are activated. F11 Reference Input is where you can specify your reference. In this example, it will be channel A. In F6 Plot Setup, you can configure what you want to see after the data is collected and during data collection. You are establishing the default plots for viewing, but after data is collected, you can still select the other plot types to review and analyze. Let's go back to the Analyze Setup screen and start the motor to begin collecting data. When you push Enter, you see the waveform and the cross-channel phase in the three additional plots. After data collection is complete, you see a transfer function plot, coherence plot, the response spectrum, and the cross-channel phase plot for A versus B. If you now select F2, Next Response Input, you can toggle between A versus B C, and D. If you want to see the other plots available, select F6 Switch Plot Type and use the Set Plot Keys to select different plots. For example, you can select F5 Set Plot 4 and choose something other than the Spectrum Response Plot, maybe the Spectrum Reference Plot instead. Now the plot in the Quad Display has changed to the Spectrum Reference Plot. You can also select F6 to change the screen display from quad to stacked. You can save all the data in the job mode by selecting F9 Store Data. This concludes our tutorial. Please continue watching to select from other recommended tutorials or visit the AMS Reliability Channel for the AMS 2140 playlist. Additional product information can be found at emerson.com AMS 2140. Thank you for watching.